is Obsuna Obsessions. <laughs> Today's vlog is all about farmer's market. So we are here at the farmer's market here in our city and um, we wanted to explore the place and we are excited and I'm going to show it to you right now. Yeah. We wanted to look around first and um, scout for the cheaper deals and then once we were done looking around and then we'll stop the shopping since this is our first time here. Then what's good thing about this place is they have enough restrooms for everyone so this is the second restroom which I saw today and yeah I love it here oh look this one out this is handicraft by Gary and silk color Clara. Okay, wow. Oh, look here. Local artisans. Oh, magnets. Very nice.
Well, towards the end of this alley, is, uh, where all the local artisans are are found, so there is a stall for the leather product. There is also a stall for handicraft, for gemstones. So all of those vendors are here. They are locals here, and they are selling. And not only being authentic, but at the same time for a cheaper price, and it's cool. Look at this one. It's dry up. It's dry. It's dry. It's dry. side of the building you'll find a lot of uh, eatery and restaurants uh, I can see from here a seafood restaurant a Mexican one and yeah and there are so many stalls of food where if you're feeling hungry you can go check that out so only this place is all for the local produce like yeah so we are at the plant sections and after this we'll proceed to the vegetable and fruit sections and grab something Another tip that I can tell you is that you should bring your cash with you because the more you use your cash, the lesser price it will take because you're not using your credit card because in credit card, there is an extra charge of tax on it. So it will be better if you're going to use your, your, your cash in shopping in here. Bring cash. Well, to be honest, this is just my first time seeing those kind of indoor and outdoor plants. What I'm trying to say is there is a variety of selection. If you're looking for any indoor plants, name it. There are rubber plants, snake plants, those kind of succulent plants, everything is in here. Of course, if you're looking for a, uh, for an outdoor or outside plant, like uh, like for bushes or those who are growing flowers or even with uh, with thorns or without, you name it. If you're gonna ask me, is there any faux plant here or like uh, fake plants? I don't think so. Everything here is like authentic, real, and. Uh, real plants so yes there is no faux plan well as of now i haven't seen any faux plan yet but yeah what i like is those those hanging ones those hanging flower ones i like it is that a vine vine plants or something yeah yeah all the selections are here you should go visit here at the farmer's market yeah that one
One, the, one thing that I wanted to buy in that particular vendor is that she called me baby Ooh, baby baby oh look at the honeys Well, I keep hearing them saying it's sweet, it's sweet, it's sweet. But I guess all of the fruit that they are selling are all sweet because it's natural. Love it. the season of blueberry and princess so that's why I can see so many peaches now and blueberries oh this is for the flowers let's look for the flowers mommy water spinach oh. mahal tatlo Two dollar each. Para ang mahal naman sa two dollar each. Para ang mahal naman sa two dollar each. Siya. Mahal pala mga bulok. I mean, two dollar is is for me expensive. If it is like first thing. Alright, so there you have it. So we just bought uh, cantaloupes and some indoor plants. Uh, we, we held back from buying an outdoor plant because we don't know actually yet what to buy. And of course, if we're going to be planting any outdoor plants, we need to ask permission from the HOA or the Homeowner Association, which we are not sure yet. Oh, good thing about here is there are also bikes for rent. <laughs> you can have yes parking space is not a problem so there is a huge parking space here bathroom two restaurant two name it uh, it is uh, it is very nearby the heart of, of of the city you just have to take the Lake Wheeler exit and then that's it and yeah thank you for hanging around with me to those who are watching my vlog hi to you all please comment down below from where are you watching my vlog from so i can uh, have a shout out next time this has been your obsuna sessions Woohoo! hey